Congratulations, Tony Rizzo, recipient of the 2020 Cleveland Association of Broadcasters Award for Excellence. Tony Rizzo grew up in a radio and television arena. His dad was the broadcast Hall of Famer, Jack Reynolds. Reynolds was a Cleveland DJ, TV host, and station announcer. He also did national play-by-play -play for WWF Wrestling. With me right now. Young Tony got to hang out with the wrestlers and was naturally a big fan. But Tony's biggest passion was the Cleveland Browns. One of his earliest memories was going to the games at the old Cleveland Stadium. It was a charm childhood that prepared him for the future. After college, Tony got his start as an overnight board operator at an AM radio station. Their FM sister station was Magic 105.7, which featured John Lanigan in the morning. The Lanigan, Webster, and Malone show didn't do a lot of sports, but they did news every half hour. Rizzo went in and said, let me get you some Browns interviews. MJI liked what they heard, and Tony finagled his way onto the morning show, working for free. After spending the morning at WMJI, Tony would head over to WHK. There he did a sports show and learned from greats like Les Levine. He also got a part-time job at Fox 8 doing Sunday Sports Page. The show won multiple Emmy Awards, and Rizzo was given more and more assignments. In 1997, Tony was promoted to Fox 8 Sports Anchor. There he gave the viewers more than just the highlights. He shared his perspective on the Cleveland sports scene. After that, he's all yours, Cleveland. In 2007, Rizzo got back into the sports talk business at ESPN Cleveland. There he would do the morning show and then head over to Fox 8 for the evening news. Tony left WJW in 2010 to concentrate on the radio show, but he still does a Sunday night show on Fox 8 called The Rizzo Show. You know what it is. It's The Rizzo Show, and it's next. Stay tuned. On ESPN, Rizzo teamed up with co-host Aaron Goldhammer on The Really Big Show. Their goal is to create on-air entertainment and drama, and every once in a while, the show feels like a WWF wrestling match. I'm just as frustrated as everybody else, but I'm not going to sit here and beat this over the head. For In 2016, Rizzo was named Scene Magazine's Best Sports Talker. His longtime prominence as a Cleveland sports reporter led him to be featured in the ESPN film Believe Land. And he was also cast as himself in the Kevin Costner film Draft Day. The Cleveland Association of Broadcasters takes great pride in saluting the Riz, Tony Rizzo.